Hey, this is Will from Lifter LMS. In this video, we're gonna talk about course tracks. And so a course track is sort of like a degree program where you could complete uh, multiple courses in order to get a certification, but it doesn't matter what order you complete them in. So if I wanted to have maybe like a design certification or like uh, a college uh, degree program or something like that, I would wanna use course tracks for that. So if I head down to tracks here under courses on my Lifter LMS sidebar, let me just call this design certification and add new course track. So now that I have created this course track, I can add courses to it. So I have three courses here. Let me go in and add all three courses to my course track. On the sidebar over here, I have tracks and I'll check my box there for that course track and then update. We'll give it a second to do that and then go back out to the WordPress admin and do the same on my other courses. Find tracks on the sidebar, select the box and then click update. Still doing a little bit of saving. There we go. And my last course here, we will add it to the track and then click update. So now that I have three courses added to my course track, I can trigger engagements based on completion of that course track. So on engagements here on the sidebar, if I were to create maybe a certificate uh, that you get this certificate after completing all three courses, I would want to head down to engagement certificates and then of course create my certificate, design it up how I'd like it. And then when I'm ready to go with my layout, I'm gonna go to add engagement and I'll say certification program I'll just call it certification program completion certificate. And we're gonna say when a student completes a course track, meaning they've completed all three courses I put in that track, we want to select a specific course track, like which course track, you could have multiple of these, and which engagement we want to award a certificate and then select your certificate. So now you need to complete all three courses in order to get the certificate. Uh, there are a couple other ways you could kind of create a prerequisite degree setup. For example, if the courses were prerequisites for one another where you wanted students to complete them in order, you could create that setup with the course prerequisite feature. But the course track feature is really useful when there's no prerequisites and you could complete them in any order, but you do have to complete all three of them to get the certificate. So now how would you sell the courses in your track, uh, sell access to the courses, for example? That's where maybe a membership would come in alongside course tracks. So if I have a membership. So I'm calling my track design certification. So let me just call my membership that as well. Certification. So I have my design certification membership and I'm going to select all three courses on my auto enrollment settings here. Perfect. So then I'll be selling this membership sort of as a course package. So you buy the design certification membership you get access to all three of these courses. And then when you complete all three of them, since I have a course track set up, you'll get the certificate that I set up uh, to be awarded. So that's kind of how memberships can work alongside course tracks in order to kind of create degree programs. All right, that's about it for this video. My name's Will Middleton from Lifter LMS. Thanks for joining me in this video, and I'll see you in the next one.